What's up guys, Charge Go here. We're back with another video. In one hand I have the aero cap, in the other hand I have some plasti dip. You know what's about to go down. So if you look down here, we got three of the aero caps and we got one over there. We're gonna see how they look in black. I don't like the look of the gray with the wrap that I have. So for 25 bucks, this might look pretty good. So we're gonna get into this. We're wiping down all the aero caps. We do a ghetto out here, you know, so it's windy. It's kind of cold out. This is some Walmart Plasti Dip, but I don't really care. And we got some raggedy cardboard over there too. That's totally fine with a, uh, with a wireless heat gun, which probably won't do much. But let's see how these wheels look. Huh. The directions on the Plasti Dip say to put three to four coats, wait about 30 minutes in between each coat. I'm not sure if I'm gonna wait that long, so this is gonna be extremely ghetto. But let's see how these look with my extremely ghetto technique in plasti dipping. This stuff smells really bad. Oh shit, it's running. Yeah. We're gonna be applying some heat because it's a little cold out and I think it adheres better to the surface with some heat, but again, I have no experience with this stuff, so who knows. This stuff also smells really bad, guys, so just FYI. And you gotta shake this like all the time. Zoom in on the finish. Any runs? Possibly. Is it running? You guys can see this one's been drying for about five minutes now, and then you can see this one when it's wet. I was kind of worried that it'd be running a lot and it kind of looks bad, but this is ultimately the finish we're going for. And I think with a lot of coats, it's plasti dip, it's pretty durable. You can get away with a lot of stuff. It's not like paint where you'll see the imperfections really easily. thickest coat for sure if you want to look up close it does look like it's running look bring the camera over here you can see some blemishes and stuff but that seems to be on every wheel actually let me get thankfully it's not running it's pretty thick durable material the key this is my fourth arrow first coat I think the key is just to go slowly side to side and don't concentrate it on one spot too much otherwise it's gonna start uh, dripping a little bit and it's not going to look good. So this is after one coat. The wheels are not looking too bad. I didn't exactly clean them. I just wiped them with a microfiber. That's probably why you see these imperfections, but with a bunch of different coats, I don't think it's really gonna show, so it's not gonna be too much of a problem. I have another one hanging out over here. This one was a thick boy, so there's a lot in the middle. It's probably gonna take a longer time to dry, but we're supposed to let them dry for 30 minutes. We're probably only gonna do half the time because we run a ghetto operation out here and it just be like that. We're putting on the second coat. It's been 30 minutes. I thought we'd only wait 15 minutes, but somehow it's been 30 minutes. It's windy. We're doing it on the floor. There's going to be some imperfections, but whatever. So 
So this is after three coats. You can see there are some imperfections, but at the end of the day, Plasti Dip is pretty durable and it's, it's Plasti Dip, what are you gonna expect? We're outside, it's windy, we don't really care. We're just trying to get an idea of how they'll look on the car, black as opposed to gray. But I think just caking on a bunch of Plasti Dip, just do your guys' thing, it's not a big deal, it's pretty easy to use, you know? It's gonna look pretty good. From, from afar it looks great, but you'll always find imperfections if you look really, really close. But I'm really happy with it so far. Fly with me, I can hold you down, no you tryna ride with me. I can be around, don't switch sides on me. I'm just tryna move walk on the sky, mommy. Yeah, get high with me, I can hold you down, no you tryna slide on me. I can be around, don't switch sides on me. I'm just tryna move yeah. walk yeah. on the sky. I like my mind stimulated, keep my time abbreviated. No for taking leaps of faith from plans I never deviated. I'm just tryna see you, baby. What's up guys? This is the final product of the plastic dip aero caps i think they look pretty good i think the rim of the wheel being gray throws it off a little bit but it's definitely a really interesting look i'm probably going to rock it for a little until the plastic dip comes off as you guys know we dip these wheels in a really ghetto way but they still came out pretty good the finish is great i'm happy with it but that's pretty much it let me know in the comments how you guys like these black plastic dip arrows should i keep them should i not keep them should I Plasti Dip or Powder Coat the wheels black so the lip or the outside of the arrow is black as well and it doesn't throw off the look that much? Or if I should do them another color or if I should get wheels or whatever? Put it down in the comments, guys. That's it for this video. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm watching you. And we'll see you in the next one.